the Ghana Lotto Operators Association, together with Concerned Lotto Agents Association of Ghana, have cautioned the government to take legal actions against the Director General of the National Lottery Authority, Mr. Kufi Osei Ameyo, for wrongfully collecting their monies a year ago for the advertised private public partnership in Lotto. The stakeholders strongly insisted that failure for government to do so will leave them no option than to march onto the streets of Ghana to proclaim the ill dealings of Mr. Osei Ameyo towards them. According to reports, Mr. Osei Ameyo collected 1 million Ghana cities from 24 operators. 5,000 each from Lotto agents and 1,800 from Lotto writers, in addition to 5 million Ghana cities worth of bank insurance guarantees from operators who intended to operate nationwide. The meeting organized by Glower and Clag yesterday, October 23, 2019, with the theme Reviewing the current lottery situation in Ghana, updated stakeholders that the monies collected under the pretext of licensing them as retailers of Lotto is still waiting for NLA's decision, regardless of the delay in the implementation of the PPP. According to the Executive Secretary of CLAG, Mr. Kweku Diateria, class concern on the whereabouts of the gargantuan payment towards the NLA agitate Mr. Kufi Osei Amiel to make panic statement, which has indeed misplaced the trust they have for him. When we raised the issue of the gargantuan payment to Osei Amiel and his NLA, they became agitated and started making panic statements all over the place. With a large bunch, the PLO of NLA, one time critic of Mr. Osamia for corruption and now spokesperson for the NLA, claims in an interview on UTV that huge sums of money collected by Osamia and his NLA are deposited into the consolidated fund and that the money is awaiting a process to scrutiny to give license to some private operators who qualify and those who do not qualify to have their monies returned to them. References of statement made by Mr. Osei Ameya on different radio and television networks on the rationale behind taking such huge monies, according to Mr. Kwekudria, is a revelation of his incompetency, a proof that disqualifies his leadership of the National Lotteries Authority. Osei Ameya had saying those huge sums of money collected from operators are at the National Lotteries. On the same program, he said the advertisement he made in the media to register these lotto operators, agents and writers, was a mistake. This tells us that the man is incompetent, cannot manage an institution like national office. Clearly, the director and the PR of NLA is not or do not know where the money is. And we take serious with Mr. Samia on, on his double tongue statement. Invite the President of the Republic to cause an investigation to be, conduct to be conducted into the matter which in no means affect the economy. They called on the President of Ghana, Nana Adodankwa Akufuado, to investigate the Director General and show him the exit for causing financial loss. The amendment of the current existing law was conveyed to government such that the NLA will be a regulator of the lottery business. We call on the President of the Republic to look to this once again. The Director General is only interested in his personal and personal aggrandizement and not the interests of Ghana and Ghanaians. We have suggested before to the government that private lotto operators could be a permanent source of income to support government, even free SHS, and that can be done, leaving each kiosk a small amount of money every month and call for a lotto fund to be created as part of the consolidated fund for that purpose. They finally caution government to address their demands before they take to the streets of the country to demand a share of their rights as Kenyans. And the culture by no say, so I saw them man or some me are quite am aware the one who are pa. Yes, you bear the any I pay. I'm really dry. So time no, they can't stop anyone. If you say it's our job, Nessa is our job. All of you are part of it. Because in case of any eventuality, in case of any eventuality, but in a benefit. In a press briefing by Dr. Atukodria, lawyer for the private lotto operators, he spoke that the meeting was purposely to update the lotto agents and writers in the Ashanti region that their paid monies made a year ago is still in the coffers of the NLA with no decision yet. <laughs> 
Director General that looked to a human nanono. On can I say straightforward? In the answer, now there be, or can we have a sister and no, can we anti trust her or more one on the moon a coffin? And then you are no quansen or organ I have, you are no bit me a year. I buy one out in the court now, near all yellow, I do so and so be a bebow soon and yet. There was a motion for him, would be busy, or said the bear. We are moving in our motor, be brazy MP before. As all money to now a comma about to know so best I could to Eddie Amau. An internet was some more or more by some women or more can he said the bear. You've been your friend who did or money license at the two lot of me. After all, when they do the lot of the pay tax, and they are by crying your home for so double. They are no one's a man, you're back. They are buying for the nine siphon and nam lot twenty. No, indeed, on the in Kugu. Our election. They should learn something. No more to two money, may ye, said the Abaya. No more can and can ye ding. It may be any gun, ha, or be a bien ye. I didn't wink one year, person, won't quiet. Oh, Nanay, who say individuals are benefited. A banker said the Omunia. Those involved are benefited and government is losing. But we did say. So, since ye not the near matter to ye, and for so bad, I'm going to be able to say private sector for no ever contribution. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it.